Mocap is something that for every animator you feel like all the work is done for you. That's an exaggeration, it's really hard. <laughs> <laughs> the reason why mocap is so great is it's one of the quickest ways to get your ideas as an animator on paper, so to speak. So you can actually see it and play with it and uh, revolve the camera around whatever you want to look at in 3D space. Uh, especially for fight choreography, since you're thinking so quickly about you know what comes next naturally, it's really easy to act it out first, and then kind of play around with what you want to do. I mean, what can you say about the dome? It's a dome. Uh, when I saw it on the internet, I, I just knew that's where we need to be for the week, and it's uh, it's really awesome. It's it's here in Austin on the side of a mountain. Uh, just driving up here is, is beautiful on its own. Hanging out in here is crazy. It's like something out of a fairy tale. It kind of feels like where the Lost Boys would hang out. I've always been a big fan of uh, Shane and Dylan's work. Uh, Shane's got his amazing Mega Man series, and uh, Dylan's got his uh, fighting Minecraft series, and they're both super popular. Animating. With Dylan and JJ doing some VR experiments. It's been pretty cool. Looking at things different than I'm used to, like, it makes me want to work in it more and get all these new ideas of potential. So, uh, with the, all the stuff we've been doing this week, there's going to be a lot of cool and interesting things with the mocap that we took and the scene that we've been setting up, and I'm really excited to see how it's going to end up. You know, for example, in like a game engine or something with some interactivity, uh, some really cool ideas there that I'm, I'm excited to, to see how it turns out.